Dr. Maxis. What it is, I'm Kevin, Scorchard Gaming. Today I'm bringing you another guide in Dark Souls 3, this time on where you can farm for vertebra shackles. And you need those for the Mount Maker Covenant. 10 of them will score you the Bloodlust Katana, and 30 will score you the Almighty Pyromancy Warmth. So you want to go past the boulder of bitches and down the tunnel of fuck to meet these two fucks who fucked me over here, considering the best way I found to take them out was bull rushing them in their own tunnel. And they managed to push me all the way back here, and then I ended up with the worst camera angles possible. So like the Proof of Concord kept farm route, there's only three enemies to kill. Only this one will be shorter and not as time consuming because fuck me sideways did the Silver Knights despise dropping those things. Though after the amount of time I spent trying to get one for the video, I'm starting to think that they did that intentionally to be like, hey, you want to be a bit Blade of a Dark Moon. You want to be a Blue Sentinel because everyone's going to wear the way of the blue up until level 40. Then shit's irrelevant. Ha. Ah. Anyway, this is in Carter's Tombs. And this is the only bonfire here besides Walners, which you end up with after you kill Walners, so you shouldn't get lost. Seriously, don't get lost. This is the best route I found, personally, because there's three of them right here. The bonfire is right around the corner. It's fast, and the only time that it's difficult is that tunnel part. And since invading as a mound maker gets you ganked because it sends you into the world with most phantoms, yeah, this is a lot easier, and fuck invaders and fuck invasion, it's stupid. I absolutely hate it. I'll pop a clip at the end of this of a ridiculous fucking invasion that I tried as a pyromancer with one of my other characters. Anyway, I hope this helped, and I'll see you in the next one. Sayonara.